Knox County School District officials looking at policies on funding its playgrounds. Right now, the cost of playground installation and maintenance is left to the students' families. A Good Morning Tennessee reporter, Lexi Spivak, joins us with this push for change. Good morning, Knox County Commissioner Larson Jay has taken this issue on. He's noted at school board meetings that currently the school system does not include funding for construction, maintenance, or replacement of playgrounds in its budget. Now, he wants all that to change. Jay says that the burden should not be on the school families to raise money for playground construction and updates. Instead, that money should be put toward other needs like field trips and helping out the teachers in the school. I did reach out to Knox County Schools about this. They say, quote, while the district does not currently fund playgrounds, the superintendent has directed staff to develop standards so we can assess the cost of including playgrounds as part of new elementary school construction, end quote. Now, if we take Sunnyview Primary here as an example, because the playground is so old, a PTA parent says they can't just replace certain parts since the company that built it is now out of business. So they would have to replace the entire thing. I'm told that would cost more than sixty or $70,000. We have more about this issue online at WATE.com. 